where she's from. I see your roots. Your roots are here. Hello. Hello. Truth now. Long and soft. is expression. All of this is is needed all over the place. Um, everybody is stressed out to the max right now. I don't know if we're breathing spent something from the oil spill or if it's the chemtrails or if it's what it is or if it's just like or something happened at the G20. Maybe we're uh, being bombarded now with microwaves from uh, some high-tech conspiracy that uh, I don't even know about. <laughs> All that really matters is that you have the ability to express yourself. Well, everything else matters too. But uh, expression is the answer. It's the it's it's. We stop living in fear. The fear has no power. I have no idea what I'm doing. All I know is that what I'm doing is just waiting and being open. And when things arrive, you gotta take care of them. This RBC bombing that happened in Ottawa, it hits close to home because that's where I'm from. I hope people don't think it's not, it's important. Because it is really important. Um, that could change everything, and uh, if we can get some good police officers out there who might have been involved in this to actually come forward and perhaps help us find out who it is who gives the orders for these things, it is not a crime to, uh, to believe in something. And if these guys are being falsely accused for, for bombing a bank and they don't even know what FFFC stands for, then obviously somebody else is involved here and if we can find out who it really was unlike Montebello where they just publicly tell us that that yes it happened there was provocateur as well after even talking to a lot of cops a lot of cops think that it's justified that they dress up like us pro like protesters I wasn't at the G20 myself but many people were there and if, if the people who are who are speaking truth start getting impersonated by imposters, which happens all the time. We all have our own separate opinions, and uh, when it gets down to it, the truth does not give a shit about your opinion. What's the truth? That's the banana man. He's the man, the banana man. Truth now. Absolutely. Yesterday. We will interview anybody. Anybody. Stephen Harper wanted to talk to us. We'd listen to him. I'd put it on this YouTube thing or whatever. The public... The public board of truth. We will have to... We will. And Vern White from the Ottawa Police is on my list. And... Whoever the future mayor is going to be of Ottawa that's coming up this fall. There are many, many that need to be talked to. Simply given the ability to go on camera and say what they need to say. And sometimes it has to be done in secret and I'm more than happy to... Uh, not inform people that I'm recording unless they ask. If they ask, I won't lie. That's it. You can record anybody. You are allowed to do anything. As long as you haven't been notified or you're on private property. Or the combination of those two. This is the best way to find out what's really going on and if we get enough important people to speak the truth. 
or speak lies, which we know are lies. The only people you don't want to go around recording are graffiti writers. Yeah. At night. Don't record people doing graffiti at night. They won't like it. No. You know, especially if there's $500 rewards for, uh, for <laughs> you to rat them out. Like, Give respect to Those people are expressing themselves. What they're doing is not a crime. They own this public property just as much as you do, just as much as the cops do. No. It's the public. We all own it. There are boundaries, of course. And there are certain things you want to do and don't want to do. It's not what you should and shouldn't do. Everybody has to make that decision for themselves. The most important thing is that everybody knows that this black bloc or these anarchists and such are not against the public. They are not going to attack people in the streets. You do not need to be afraid. The axe murderers are no longer stalking the streets. Now it's just people playing music and doing, doing art with paint and love is all over. That's smoking weed that is, it's not a crime in Canada, just, just, it's just not a crime in Canada. <laughs> what is criminal? What's criminal is the fraud that's being put against the public by making them believe the biggest lie that paper has more value than gold. Don't work too hard. Yeah, I will, I will, by the way, I will travel anywhere to interview anybody. And this is Bridget McDrop and stuff, mm -hmm. and uh, she'll go anywhere if you simply pay the accommodations and the travel fare to get there, and she'll travel anywhere and go to whatever the top of any building you have access to to drop whatever you want off the top. Yeah, get it out there. It's a service. Essential service.